Hello, this is demo of Group Stock Manager version 2.0. So there are two products in my store. They are actually the same products, but I am selling them in uh, two different categories: one for the men and the other for women. So I'm going to see this how it looks on uh, admin settings. So it's a variable product here. You can see. Um, so what I want to achieve is uh, when I sell a product variation for yellow large men's t-shirt, the variation stock for yellow large women's t-shirt should also reduce. They both share quantity with each other. this variation so I'm going to create a group for these uh, products So here uh, you can see the products and along with it you have the variations. You can select the variations here. So I'm going to select yellow large which I have set up there and uh, yellow large okay and I'm going to set up the quantity for each of them 10 so so now men's t-shirt yellow large and women's t-shirt yellow large both have stock quantity of 10 as well as when order comes through first let's see in the admin that yellow large so it has stock quantity of 10 now let's try ordering this on the front end and also let's check the woman stock for variations as well this is also 10 as we have set up in the groups so now let's try ordering the product so it will reduce stock for both the products in the admin I'm going to order it. Okay. okay, so the order is placed now. Now let me refresh the stock groups. So the quantity here is reduced to 9. Now let's see the product stocks. First, let's check, let's check about men's t-shirt. Yellow large. It is 9. Now let's check about women's t-shirt. That is also 9. So this is how the group stock manager plugin works. It allows you to share stock quantity between variations of variable product of different like variations of different products and uh, also you can choose here simple products as well. And search groups here and uh, pagination. So uh, let me know if you have any doubts on the workflow. Thank you.